Welcome to Monday Morning Glads. I'm Kieran Doolittle. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this is your KWHS News. We're kicking off our Monday with Moose's Music Minute. Take it away, Moose. Good morning, Glads, and welcome back to Music Monday. The first song we have on our list is Love Me Less by Max. If I introduce you to my team, let's tell me, baby. Coming up on number two of our roster is going to be Right Side Up by Melf. And finally, it's going to be My Favorite Clothes by Remy. That's it for this Monday's edition, Glads. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you later. Thanks for sharing those cool new tunes, Moose. Juniors and seniors, there's one final college visit scheduled this month, this Wednesday. Check in with the Counseling Center to pick up your pass to visit with the reps from Western Colorado University. As always, check out all the other college information in person at the Counseling Center or check their website online. Juniors, you have one more state test to take this week. The CMAS test will be tomorrow during periods 1 through 4. Check the lists posted in the halls to find your testing location. Juniors and seniors, here's your prom update. Prom 2019 around the world will be this coming Saturday at the Double Tree World Arena from 6 p.m. to midnight. Tickets are still on sale, but only until tomorrow. Remember, your ticket price does include dinner and you cannot buy tickets at the door. Prom voting will start Wednesday and run through Friday. Prom candidates will be announced at the prom assembly on Friday and the winners will be revealed at the dance. Of course, since it's prom week, here's the schedule for this week's spirit days so you can get your outfits ready. Today is hiker day. Tomorrow is hippie day, so wear all your funky, fun, and fresh 60s and 70s gear. Wednesday is Nike vs. Adidas day. Which gear gets your loyalty? Thursday is dress to impress. We know you clean up well, so show us how you do you. And finally, Friday is class colors day. Wear your class colored to win those Charlie Cup points. For all spirit days, hats are allowed as long as they fit the theme. Stay tuned to the Gladiator Sports Update with Isaac Fleet to hear about the upcoming dodgeball tournament. Take it away, Isaac. Sports time! Good Monday morning, Glads. I'm Isaac Fleet, and this is your Gladiator Sports Update. Glads, dodgeball sign-ups start today and run through April 24th. To sign up your six-person team for this year's tournament, see Miss Melton in room 103. The cost per team is a mere $5. The games begin the week of April 29th. May the odds be ever in your favor. On April 17th, Student Cabinet will be hosting a tailgate at 4 p.m., followed by the Powder Puff game at 5 p.m. at CA Foster Stadium. Miss Melton has the details, so check in with her. If you would like to check out the Ultimate Frisbee Team schedule and learn more about their sport, check in with Mr. Nell in room 116 for those details. In tennis news, our ladies were at Memorial Park over the weekend and they made it through the tough weather to earn some great results. The ladies are on the courts again tomorrow against the Purple School at Mesa starting at 3.45 p.m. Go out and support them for the win. The Gentlemen Grizzlyators will be in their home waters on Wednesday at 4 p.m. against Pueblo South. Come and watch the Mermen swim their way to victory. Our Gladiator baseball team took on the Discovery Canyon Thunder on Friday instead of Saturday and the weather was the biggest winner. The boys are back on the mound today against the Chatfield Chargers on Big Blue at 4 p.m. Come rally the boys to a victory. Our ladies soccer team was in Florence over the weekend, and as promised, the weather was a bit wacky, but our girls played their hearts out. The ladies will be on the road tomorrow to play the TCA Titans at 4 p.m. Come out and support the girls to a win. Stay tuned to this Friday for Damon's Dose of Health. The focus of this week's segment is tech time and the impact it has on us. In track and field news, our gladiator teams were at the Mitchell Invite and performed as expected. Way to go, Glads. 
In music news, the Pops in the Park concert will happen at Paiute Park on May 5th and will feature the very talented students from our WHS band programs. Of course, since it is Cinco de Mayo, Sproul's mariachi band will also be there playing some festive tunes. Me gusta. Rounding out the performance will be Quincy Brown, a percussionist from the Air Force Academy Band, who will be joining the crew. Come listen to some amazing music from our talented musicians and enjoy a treat from the Mexican food trucks and Kona Ice. The show will be from 1 to 3 p.m. And finally, if you're interested in playing football next year or just want to meet the new coach, join Coach Zimmerman for a pizza lunch and presentation today in Bowers Gym. That does it for me. We'll be back on Wednesday with scores and results. I'm Isaac Fleet. Now back to the news desk with Kieran and Ethan. Thanks for that update, Isaac. Glad. Registration for summer credit recovery classes is going on right now and the deadline to sign up is May 30th. The summer session starts on June 3rd and runs until July 28th with the orientation on June 3rd in the WHS Computer Lab. Check the district website to register or see your counselor. GLADS, remember that April is National Donate Life Month and you can sign up to be an organ, eye, or tissue donor when you get your license or state ID. If you already have those but didn't become a donor, you can go to their website and do it online. And now, for something a bit lighter, here's Miss Betsy to tell us what wonderful meals she is preparing for us today and tomorrow. Happy Monday, everybody! Happy Monday! Five weeks to go. Today we're having Salisbury steak with mashed potatoes and gravy, and tomorrow we're having chicken sandwiches! Woohoo! So yummy! See you later! Bye bye! Thanks, Miss Betsy. Glads, stay off conditions by paying your outstanding lunch fees in person or online. Check Infinite Campus to see if you are on conditions and get those cleared as soon as possible. Remember everyone, but especially seniors, waiting until the last minute to clear your conditions means your summer starts without you. Avoid FOMO and the long line and clear your conditions early. Speaking of seniors, mark April 25th on your calendar for one more reason. It's Senior Sunset Service. Come spend one last evening with your senior class members at Barnstormers Park from 7 to 8.30 p.m. Enjoy games, music, and camp coffee with the class of 2019. Glads, our art students have two art shows where they are sharing their best work. The first is the district art show on April 20th at French Elementary from 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. This show will have artwork from students in all grades. The high school student showcase will be at the UMB Bank at 502 Security Boulevard. The opening reception for the high school showcase will be on May 1st from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. But the show will be hanging from April 23rd through May 3rd. Both shows are free and open to the public. Remember, April 25th is the PLTW Engineering Student Showcase of their senior project projects and activities at 6 p.m. in the WHS Auditorium. Our vocal music students will also be on campus on April 25th at 6 p.m. in the WHS cafeteria to showcase their vocal talents. The cost is $3 for students and $5 for adults, and refreshments will be available for a small cost, so bring some extra cash and enjoy the show. April 25th is also the day our district is celebrating our Day Without Hate. Remember to wear white to show our support for this year's theme. Do what is right, not what is easy. This is a class competition, so get your white on for Charlie Cup points. Stay tuned for information on how to get your event wristbands and then check out the posters around our school celebrating this event. And finally, pick up and fill out your reverse power cards celebrating our amazing teachers in the attendance office, library, or counseling center. Drop them in the box and we'll do the rest. Thanks for tuning in today. Have a great Monday. I'm Kieran Doolittle. And I'm Ethan Simon. And this was your KWHS News. Have a great week.